In this video, I'm going to be installing a WB9 KZY Key All HV module into a ham keyer box. I installed these modules into my ham keyers to isolate the high voltage of the old tube transmitters from destroying the sensitive electronics in the ham keyer box. This is an older module. I've had it installed for over 10 years with no issues whatsoever. All right, first step of the installation is to add an RCA jack. So you get your direct and grid key outputs, but you need to add the key all output. You can take and reconfigure one of these, but I elect to add one so I still have the full functionality of the keyer box. So I'm going to be adding this little chassis mount RCA to the rear of this unit. We'll get the module mounted and wired up. All right, I've installed the RCA jack on the rear panel of the ham keyer box. Next, we need to get this module mounted. I'm just going to use Velcro and stick it to the back panel. Then we only got four wires to connect. The red is the switched 6 volt DC. The orange is the output of the key all module. Output 2 is actually strapped to ground. And that's because I'm sharing the ground with the transmitter through that chassis mount RCA jack. Then we have the white which will go to the direct output RCA jack and the black being ground. So the red wire goes to the switched contact of the rotary switch. This is the wire that goes to the battery pack. So you just tack solder onto one of those terminals. Module installation is complete. Time to verify it using my multimeter and my pedal. Looks good. Let's hook it up to a transmitter for the final test. Okay, I'm connected to a Johnson Challenger. Here is a voltage that's sitting on the output of that key all jack. 32.5 volts. I don't think those little transistors in the ham keyer would like that. All right, now we're going to transmit CW mode into a dummy load monitoring on my Kenwood 820. Working like a champ. Let's hook it up to a Viking 2. So now we're hooked to a Viking 2 in CW mode. Voltage being applied to the key all is 18 volts. All right, same deal I'm monitoring on my Kenwood 820. Another successful installation of a key all module into one of my ham keyer boxes. These modules are small enough to fit in most of these portable keyers on the market. You don't have to run them externally. Check out WB9KZY's website for more information and detailed installation instructions.